need to hide. <laughs> but seriously, <laughs> I swear down that your father will do well in the fourth marathon race coming up. That's yeah. if he decides to contest. Let me just tell you the truth. My father doesn't have any strength. You don't just want to see what he has to do. That's the truth. And that worries me, but I, uh, I don't know the reason he's treating me like this. Is it because I graduated from the university and still reside in this village without a job? Hey, Obi, please don't talk like this now. No, why would I talk like that? Come to think of it, if I'm to be a rich dude, having all these exotic cars, big mansions everywhere, your father will not treat me like that. He will worship me for what I have. But there's no problem. I know what I'm going to do. Mm, what are you going to do? I'll just leave this village for good, go to the city and look for a greener pasture. Let me know when I make the money if you will still treat me like that. City? You want to go to the city? I hear now, that's the only thing I uh, can do in this situation. Please, uh, before you go to the city, you just have to come to my house and pay my bride price. So I'll pay it to you. Actually, I love you too, but how can I pay your bride price with your father's attitude? Your father will never accept that diary from me, it's impossible. He will accept it though. Do you know what my father is waiting for? He's just waiting for you to come to my house and tell him that you want to marry a large. He will accept it. That's when he will break my head. Let's go to Emma and Tuchi and buy bread and a cream for her. Thank you. Do you have money? We'll tell her that we'll pay her to her. I'm scared of going home because I don't know what my father will do to me. That's why I suggested I take you home. Come, let me take you home. Take you home. Eh? Don't... No, 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 no. Hey, tell my father to break your head. Hey, no, don't worry. I know how to handle it. He's my father. He will not do anything to me. Huh? I'm sure about that. Mm -hmm. Because I'm, I know why I'm talking. I don't want any dent on your skin. Hmm. That's when I'm going to lose it. If he's going to do something stupid, let me accompany you home now. He is still my father and he is old. He cannot give birth to a beautiful Olachi again. <laughs> yeah, you're right, but don't say that man is old. He's just playing. I know what he's doing. Mm -hmm. But the truth is that I'm, I'm getting tired of all this thing. I'm telling you, see you tomorrow, leaving you behind. I just want to be with you all the time. If I wake up in the morning, you're around me. In the afternoon, in the night, you're there to give me my dinner. I mean, it gives me joy, darling. Oh, baby. I feel like going home with you. But, you know, you cannot go home with me because of my mother. You know, that's why I want to get married to you right now. To avoid all this insult of people telling us what to do. Okay, but I just pray your father will be a blockage. I'll pray about it.
I have told you, look at what you did to yourself. I have told you to leave these people alone. Eh? They, they are looking for who to implicate them. But, but they want to implicate somebody. And they will implicate me. Because I'm going to kill them. If I don't kill them, they will kill me in this land. Hey, Papa, Papa, nobody is dying. Mm -mm, I disagree with you. What you have to do is to go to Nwara's house. Tell the parents that you don't want Nwara to be seeing my sister Olachi again. Your daughter. Tell them that whatever Nwara sees out of this, he will take it that way. That is what you have to do. Nobody is dying. Don't make me believe that this, these ears of yours are just fancy on this head. I have told you severally that I have been to their house. I have told his parents. In my presence, his parents warned him. But this boy would not listen. He insisted on dying in my hands and wish one day I would grant him the favor. Ah! Olachi! Come out here! You are doing me. Why? Come out. Whatever we are saying here is for your own good. You are busy. You are hiding there. You are peeping us, Abi. Come here! Come here, come here. I have told you, Mora is a non entity. He doesn't have anything in his, in his head. Leave that boy alone for your own good. The earlier, the better. The earlier, the better. Who told you I'm hiding? I saw you hiding. Me. It's like you don't have respect. You. You don't have respect, Okwaya. Let me tell you, in case you don't know, Mora is a graduate. Mora has full strength. He has power like a man. He's a hard working young man. Let me tell you another one. You see, Mora, he has all the qualities they want in a man. Yes! Ah! about the lady. Oh, you even have the guts to come here and place a defense on that idiot? That hopeless thing? I see. Wait for me. I will let you know the difference now. She took that way. She took his side. Take any man. Don't stop pleasing me. You are the cause of this whole problem. You! You! Please now. Take it easy. Eh? Please, take it easy. She don't know my daughter. Things are happening in this village. So disgusting. I saw a man and a woman making love on a main road like this. Yeah! On a broad day. Can you imagine that? Yes. Can you just imagine that? I said I will not die. You will not kill me. My son will not kill me. I will not develop hypertension because I have a son. Yes, I will not do it. Nice. But uh, let me ask, am I the only person that I have had a son before? Why? What is happening? No. Nice. What has Laura uh, done again? What has he not done? I ask what has he not done? Look at when I was coming, I met him, uh, Mazuki, say, raging and running to my house with matchet, coming to set me on his car with my son. If not that I met on the road, why would I don't know what would have happened in this house. But I don't tell me this is all about all our chief. If not, who else? Hey! One is that I don't know what that girl has met my son and they have taken away his house. He has hypnotized him. He's not behaving, he's no longer himself. Nice. What is it? Hi! Come, come, come. Let me have this question. I don't know if I am the, the, the father of this guy. I don't know because I never see a hint God that will be like him. But then, where is he? No. Right behind you, Papa. Just right behind you. Um, I, 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 let me ask you. Eh? Um, Mora, what has this girl already did to you that has taken away your mind that now you are no longer yourself with a high person? What has it done to you? Answer, Papa. Hey? Oh, you, you remember what that man did to you? You remember? You remember what because of her daughter? Hey? You see? I love this girl. I love Mora, you won't get me! You won't get me! What do you know about love? They're talking oh. about sensible things and you're talking about love. Thank you, Mama. You know the way they hate you. Mama, Mama, forget about this hatred of a thing. You know what the man is doing. He's trying to scare me out for marrying his daughter. Stop! I hate you! Stop! You say something sensitive. You're talking about love. You're talking about love. Oh, Mama, you're trying to give me pressure like this. Hey! 
No amount of pressure will make me leave that girl. You see, Period. My son has it. Hey. 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 Why are you not kill me? You want to kill me in this house? You can't kill me! Look at the kind of names! This man is calling me because of all these things! No, 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 I don't like the way you are talking like this. What, what are you talking? Is he behaving like me? Papa, is okay now. Is he behaving like, like me? Say why? I don't know where the song is coming from. This is where it's coming from. You don't know what is wrong. That girl was lucky I did not meet him in the house today. I met his father on the way. Otherwise, out of hand. Has it, has it gotten to a point that you go to his father's house wanting to attack him with a machete? It has gone beyond that. So long as he doesn't want to leave my daughter for me, it has gone beyond that. And I am prepared to attack him, even kill him anywhere. There is no solution we are looking for. The only solution is that this boy stays away from my daughter. Let him leave my daughter alone for me. And all that she should face her future. If they don't, two heads are going to roll in the streets of this land. Stressing yourself over this matter. See, Papa, nobody can separate I and Moral. He even said he's, he's coming to, to pay my bride price. Olash, what did you just say? Will you shut up your mouth? Can you put him in the name What did you say? I didn't hear you. Papa, you heard me. That one is coming to pay my bride price. I will pay you this Octana!
Coward! Come, 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 come out. Come. What is this useless brother of yours? Is, is everything all right? Oh. You look at me and you think everything is okay. Provide him before I set this house ablaze. I've not even set my eyes on him since morning. Uh, don't tell lie to me. Don't! Provide him immediately! How can I tell you lie? How can I lie to you? I've not seen him. In fact, I was about to go in now before you came. I swear, I've not seen him. Uh, anyway, tell that useless thing that by the time he finishes riding, he should also avoid me in this village. Because any day I set my eyes on him, I will give him premature death. Do you understand? Hey. Tell him. And deliver the same message to your parents. Umura will never listen. This man has no motive with his son. Umura, stay away. Stay away. Oh. Oh, wow. Eh? So now some person for that, I become. Mora! Hey! 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 You startled me! Startled? What are you scared of? It's all Lash's father. All Lash's father nearly broke my head for my involvement with her daughter. <laughs> no, 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 no. It's not a laughing matter. Mora! Is all Lash the only girl in this village? Huh? Why do you want to die because of this girl? There are too many, too many beautiful girls in this village. When I say beauty, very beautiful. Boobs, ass, everything that you can take from. Ah! What are you Water. 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 How many times I call you? When do you think this war with all Archie's father will end? By the time I get married to all Archie now, all this nonsense and sorts will end. What's the meaning of this nonsense? Eh? He will chase me to east, north, south, and west because I love the daughter. Get married to Orachi. Are you. <laughs> I'm, I'm planning to pay Orachi's bride price. I'm telling you now because you guys are my friends. Oh, I will hear you. We will hear you. Please, where are you going from? Oh, I want to go at, uh, see my babe. Well, come now. You are doing six. six. Come on, this one you always hide here. Very soon, I'll block that road. Is Papa around? Papa is not around. Why are you hiding? Mm -hmm. Always, you're always at that junction. I'm in serious trouble. What is it again this time? I don't know what happened. Papa caught I and Mora. Huh? Mm. Where? When? How? You know Papa now, he's an old man. We we're not doing anything bad. But now he'll be seen as if we were doing something bad. You were doing something good. What were you doing? I'm gonna take it easy now. Oh, uh, so that I'll know where to help you from in case Papa comes in emergency. Okay. Uh -huh. We were trying to kiss. Hey, what? Kiss it! Oh, you were trying to do. Ah, I was. I'm trying to. Papa was looking at you face to face, and you were trying to 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 kiss. Eh? Papa, no wonder you were just just do it today. Oh, today is a special day. You just do it. So you go and do it quick, quick. Thank God, pa Papa caught you. you. Don't have expectations. No, let me know how to judge you from. Oh, Papa will soon come. Look. Oh. We are not doing it in Papa's presence. We have not even done it though. We are about doing it before he now saw. Okay, you did it in Papa's absence. Hey, you! You! Papa! Hey. Papa! 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 You! Papa! Papa! This guy! No, Warren. No! No! Tell me you didn't mean what you just said. Nah, uh, my 
brother, I meant everything that I said. I'm planning to pay Olaichi's bride price. After paying it, I'll move to the city with her and search for a job. What am I doing in this village? At least all this nonsense will stop. Chike, Nora said he's going to marry a girl. Which their parents disapproved of their relationship. How do you think they are going to give her to him in marriage? When they don't even approve of common relationship. Can you have a point to... Have a point too. Okay, what on now, tell me. What makes you think that Mazi Okezu will give all like his hand to you in marriage? Now tell me. Well, uh, the truth is that I don't know how it's going to happen. But I don't know. But something in me tells me that it's possible. Love, they say, conquers all bonds. I believe the love we have for each other will, will, will open up new doors. Who knows? I sincerely hope it works out fine for you guys too. Yes. To work out, to work out. But if you ask me, <laughs> I would say that you are dreaming of impossibility. Unless you are planning of eloping with the girl. Oh, Which would be a stupid thing. You know. Am I stupid? Far from me. No, no, no. Why would I do such thing? Just watch and see. We're in this village together. Or the car. Eh? Okay. Watch and see. Don't worry. Leave everything for me. So, I just hope it works out well. Mm. It's real. It's real I, I don't get you, Nkechi. Are you suggesting we should give our daughter's hand in marriage to that, that, that non-entity? Futureless and hopeless somebody? No, I never said anything like that. But are you not tired of putting up a fruitless fight? Are you not? Okay. What have we not done to stop them? They are moving closer and stronger towards each other every day. Now, what baffles me is what you said you saw them doing last night. If all like she takes in for that boy, if she gets pregnant for him, don't you know that would be an abomination? Imaro. Oh, of course, that will not happen. It will never happen. But if it does happen, I will kill her. I will end her. Okay, you will kill her. You will end her. You think killing her is the solution? Let me tell you what will happen if you kill your daughter. You will not only lose her, you will go to jail for us. Enolia, none of us bargained for this thing. Is it not better we leave them peacefully <laughs> and save our family name? Okay, Roma. God forbid. Eh. I will never, never give Olaji, my own daughter, to that, that nobody. Because as far as I'm concerned, he is not existing. Okay. What are you going to do? Hmm? Are you not tired of fighting in vain? Are you not? Nine. A stitch in time saves nine, if you ask me. A stitch in time saves nine. Let us leave these children alone. Let us leave them and save our family name. Okay, one man, each one. Now. If you leave these children to continue doing what they are doing, whatever she does, it is the same name. Wherever she goes, our name. So the best I can do is what I'm doing now. Is that name I'm protecting? Hey, I finally decided to go to school. No! Say something else. Uh, your younger brother is traveling to abroad. No, Obin. Obin, you know what? I, my father has agreed. No, he has approved that you get married to me. Your own father or another person's father? My own father. Come here, darling. Obin, yes. Don't 
Okay. If I tell you the latest headline, you will not believe it. Tell me. Onashi's father has finally given his approval. Okay. Approval on what? Onashi's father said, I cannot go with my kinsmen to perform Onashi's traditional marriage rights. See? Blocking you. Blocking me, my dear. Yeah, yeah. Tell me, how were you not able to convince him? How I was able to convince him? Uh -huh. Did I tell you to leave that for me? I know how they treat all these people. Forget all those things he was doing, running up and down. I know how you fool all these people. The young man is tired. Huh. He had no option. So much. Come on, sister. You don't need a suit here to tell you that I love this. Okay. With the way I talk of her in the morning, in the afternoon, in the night, even while sleeping. On oh. Ashley, on Ashley. <laughs> you should know everything, now. You know everything. Aura. I hope you won't turn out tomorrow to break her heart. Because I will never forgive you. I will not. But sometimes you just sound so silly. Why will I do such thing to the woman I love? Am I mad? No, I will not try such thing, my dear. Don't worry about that. That's just so. go inside. Prepare something very delicious. Please don't <laughs> You know this calls for celebration. <laughs> it's which money now? Then Papa drop money for free. You know, I'm jobless now. Let us tell Hey! So now you know you are jobless and you are planning on getting married because there is no money. Why didn't you drop anything? What do you know about marriage? What concerns marriage? Uh, it's going to sound There is no food. Don't spoil my mood. There is no food. Uh, Mazo Kizia, my good friend. My son here said that uh, he saw an apple in a compound. Very beautiful one, which uh, he cannot take his eyes away from. So he decided to ask us to accompany him to your house so that he can legally block the apple. Eh? Uh, 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 I, I don't understand what you're talking about. Uh, I, I don't grow apples here. And my compound is not a vineyard. I, I, I don't. As you can see, we are aware that you are a full-fledged Igbo man. We understand the parables and adages of Igbo land. We are aware that some differences which have been already resolved. Yes. Please, let us go back and face the issue we are here for. Uh, Olachi. Olachi. Papa. Come. My elders, I greet you. <laughs> Do you know these people? This man? Yes. Oh, he's asking your hand in marriage. Do you accept? Yes, Papa. <laughs> it has what? It's a go. I know this wine will not go to back without without being drunk. What's your case here? Oh God! Nani. Nani, why are you in such a mood? I'm in such a mood because I'm bereaved. <sighs> yes, I'm bereaved. A man <sighs> that loses his only daughter has the right to mourn her. Nani, what are you talking about? Our daughter is not dead. To me, all that she's dead. She's dead. God forbid. Olachi is not dead. My daughter will not die. 
Nothing will happen to her. What do you think? Something has already happened to her. It has happened to her. A girl that decided to give herself to a useless non-entity. What is the difference between life and dead? It is as good as dead. Oh, glad she is dead. But, but, but she caused it herself. I, I, I didn't cause it. We have not lost anybody in this house. We are not going to lose anybody in this house in Jesus' name. What is this? Nkechi. Nkechi. If you like, you come a dumb. Now leave here before I destroy something now. Whether you're destroying something or you're repairing it, I will leave. But I'm telling you, we've not lost anybody in this house. Leave my presence before I lose my What is this? What can I do? Thank you, Tracy. You really made my day. Mm -mm. No, you made my day. Thanks for being my friend. Here, I have this money. I want you to buy some clothes for yourself. You know, change your wardrobe for tomorrow's outing. You promised, right? <laughs> wow. <laughs> Thank you, darling. I, I really appreciate it. It's okay. You're welcome. Thanks a lot. Okay. Take care. Okay. What is happening? What are you talking about? I will tell you. I saw Tessie, Chief um, Omeka Agu's daughter, mm -hmm. and Wara. If you see the way they were catching phone, I mean, they were staring at each other romantically. What is happening? My sister, if I know what is happening, I will tell you. I know nothing. You don't know? I don't know. All I knew is that. Two nights ago, the guy came up with a story that he met this girl on the way, she was lost and she, was, uh, she wanted to go back to her father's house and uh, he took her back. But there was something funny he said, that there was this funny way uh, the girl was looking at him and uh, you know, until fine boy level. Fine boy now. But I told him that what, this direction you're going, I'm not comfortable with it. And he said that I have, I'm, 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 I'm always suspicious. Okay, what about all Archie? Is that the question? That was what I asked him. But I warned him that the direction he was taking, it was going to accumulate to something else. And, and this is it now. It's only what I'm doing. I didn't I saw them yesterday, the way two of them were awoke. It seems like they have something in common. I hate to admit this, but that guy is screwing up. No, the, the, guy, the guy is messing up. But I always play my part. And my part is to play that good friend I am. I always advise him. your friends? Uh... No, for real. Whenever he's, if he's going wrong, I'll tell him. And I've just told him. And I'll know his text to tell him again. But please, both of you, you want to do me a favor. What is it? I don't want any gossip. No, seriously, I don't want any of you to go around telling things before it gets to all Archie. Uh, I hear. You did not say anything. No, I did not say anything. You did not but say you anything. Advise him well, Lou. I will advise him. Uh, I will not. I will not tell him anything. Look, I don't trust this girl. Why are you acting this way? Okay, 
Okay, I I'm sorry to say this. Why are you behaving like this now? Is it because I, I don't allow you to enter our car? It's not about entering the car. It's your attitude. Just hey. look at the way you spoke to her because, because you offered to, to, to help us. Hey. Isn't that wrong? You Is that an attitude of a good woman? Please, you misunderstood me. No, you were the one that misunderstood me. Because you acted like I, I, I'm gonna disappear if, if, if I enter the car with her. What, what, what kind of nonsense is that? Okay, I'm very sorry. I will not do it again, I'm sorry. Go home, I'm, I'm very angry right now. Mm. And it looks like we're having trust issues in this relationship. And that's uncalled for. There is no way I can go home. All right. When I know that you're still angry with me, just tell me that. Tell me that you're no more angry, I'll go. Would you please go back to your house? You've dated me for a very long time and you know the way I behave. I'm angry right now and there's nothing you can say that will put me through. Just go home. Go home tomorrow. We'll continue from where we start. Tell me you've forgiven me, else I will not go. Okay, I've forgiven you. I can go. Thank you. My love, bye bye. It's a lie. <laughs> wait, 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 you must be kidding me. You mean that girl kissed you? She kissed me, my brother. Hey. Not only kissing me, she also professed her love for me. <laughs> Isn't that a good news? <laughs> <laughs> that one is not possible, huh? Nah. <laughs> All actually has taken you. <laughs> Why should I tell her that? Huh? If this girl truly loves me and ready to marry me like she claims, then why will I be thinking of the poor old lad? Is there a need for that? It's not possible. <laughs> ha! <laughs> I was a pay one. You must be joking. Ha! How can you leave all that? Well educated. Uncle. Eh? Yeah. 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 Wait, 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 wait. Are you the one saying all this now? Yeah, uh -huh. You're the one, you, you, you. Yes. With this mouth. Eh? After eating all our cheese food. Eating what? That poison. Hey! Laura! When? It's all that we're talking about, too. Of course, I know we're talking about all that. Are we talking of one book in Jalingo? If God has decided to pick my call finally by sending Tessie in my life, then all that can go to hell. All that she's past tense, if you don't know. Well educated, first class. Wait, 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 wait. Una, they talk like they don't use juju. Catch both of you. See, I'm not going to be a party to anything that is going to break Olachi's heart. If you cannot be part of it, then you get out. You get lost. I know your plan. I know what this guy is planning. He wants to go behind my back and take Tessie from me. I know all those your plan. You're a very wicked and a jealous person. But it won't work. If you try it, I'll break you. You know what I can do now. <laughs> you know what tomorrow I can do. Walk. Foolish man. Uh, uh, don't break all at his heart. Don't do this one. Guy, forget that. And I know your plan. I know you very well. That's the same money we are talking of. Everybody's seeking for money everywhere. Mm -hmm. eh? Don't mind. Odika, are you going to pretend that you did not hear when this guy called me his enemy and a jealous friend? Uh, he didn't go out. He's been sitting there. He heard me clearly. Of course, that's who you are. Guy, you are an enemy of progress. Hear it now! That's what you are. Forget all these kind of people, I know them. Hey! Hola! Okay. Hola, you look beautiful these days. Well, I 
I don't need to ask you what the secret is. I know it's because of your forthcoming traditional marriage. So, how's it going? I hope it's going fine. The preparation. Well, you don't seem happy to me. Yes, okay. Yes, I am not happy. Seriously. For long now, I've not set my eyes on Mora. I don't know what I did to him. I don't even know if he's avoiding me. But okay, if there is anything I did to him, he is supposed to come and tell me now. At least I will know that yes, this is what I did to him. Then I will apologize. Of course. But this one, he did not tell me anything. He's avoiding me. I've not seen him. I'm just scared. Okay, please. If there's anything that is going on that I don't know, please just let me know. Tell me. Let me understand. I have to be honest. I know nothing. And I must confess that I'm so shocked to hear this right now. If I knew anything, I, 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 I wouldn't delay in telling you. I know nothing. But why don't you go to the house and find out what's going on? Do you know how many times I've gone there? Each time I go to his place, they will tell me he's not around. They will tell me he's not around. Eh? Okay, tell me. Does one I want me to kill myself? Does he want me to kill myself for him? What did I do? All I think it is on yourself, okay? Okay, you said you know nothing. Ola, I know nothing. Believe me, you know me. If I knew things, I, 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 I will tell you. There's no problem. Try and see if I can get to his place today. Please do that. Okay. Do that. Thank you. Ola. Ola. Like this, where are you going to? I'm going out to see someone who has an appointment. <laughs> Just tell me you are going to see all that. Love one. Try it, love one. Chidima, mm. Chidima, how are you? Oh, Ma, sister, how are you doing? Yeah. What about Obin? Is he inside? <laughs> yeah, Obin. He went out with his two friends, um, Chika and Odika. Um, there's no problem. Tell me my king, eh? Mm -hmm. no problem. Just that I just wanted us to discuss something. King, oh? oh. But hope no problem. I uh, will tell him, okay? I'll be on my way. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Bye bye. Oh, bye bye. Oh. Coming from your place now, where are you going to? <laughs> I just went to check on my love, but he said he went out with his friends. Who told you that? His sister. Why do you ask? It is because I saw Chike and Odika a few minutes ago, and they were not with Mora. They actually asked me to tell him he should find them at their usual joint in case I run into him. Are you sure? Ola, are you people having issues? No, we are not having any problems. Just that we've not seen for some days now. Then there's something he and the sister are not telling you. She's old, or Kagonka, she's old. Forget her. What is this? Eh? Leave my husband alone. Leave him alone. Oh, Bongidi. Oh, Jolo Jolo. Oh, leave him alone. Mora, I won't have this village thing in South. Look at her. What is she saying? Village. 
Do this last thing. Look at my stupid face. I've seen you. Idiot. What is it? Will you just hold yourself and be reasonable for once? Get this into your greasy hair. What we had is history. It is over. What is the You heard me louder. I am no longer interested in this relationship or marriage or whatever you chose to call it. Get yourself another man. I have gotten mine. Please don't talk like that. Now. Please, I beg you. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Last time you will embarrass me in front of my, my, my fiance. Oh, please don't do this. Please. Go and leave me alone. I'll, I'll, I'll slap you. I'll slap you. Come on, I'll slap me. Slap my back. Okay. You never say any good thing in your life. You have the guts to treat me like this. You open this in your mouth. So tell me that you don't know me. Because you've seen City Girl. You opened your mouth and denied me in front of that girl, Wara. My God will punish you. My God will judge you. Watch. Brother, please talk to me. Why are you crying? Okay. <laughs> Do you know that Mora has been cheating on me? I caught him with that, that city girl. <laughs> that one they call uh, uh, Tessie. Uh -huh. I caught them kissing. What? <laughs> but Do you know the most painful part of it? Mora denied me in presence of that girl. Mora said that he doesn't know me. That he has not even seen me in his life before. Uh, is he crazy? Mora opened his mouth and said he has not seen me in his life before. Mora, after everything, who does not know I am Mora in this village? Mora has the guts. Mora has the guts to deny me, okay? What did I do to Mora? That must be crazy. Mora, my God will judge you. Mora. My God will judge you. No, there is no problem. Oh. There is no problem. Oh, well, because I am not a city girl. You have seen a city girl. And you not said you don't know that she again. Oh, no, my God will punish you. You see yourself. No problem. Me. Oh. Hola, please take it easy. Hola. I came back to this house some hours ago. And I saw Orachi crying. When I asked her what the problem was, she told me that you disgraced her before that rich girl and told her that you are no longer interested in her. Is that true? Yes, Papa. Why? Oh, Papa, do we have to go through this again? We have to go. I told you my heart does not accept her anymore. Tessie is the woman my heart beats for. And she's the one I want to spend the rest of my life with. Can't you understand it? Okay, okay, okay. So, uh, let me ask you this question. What happened to the marriage introduction we did in her father's house? And the dowries we paid? Oh, Papa, they can, they can keep the change as, as compensation for whatever inconveniences this must have cost them. Yes. Mora, listen and listen very well. You see this thing you are going about trying to do? I will never be part of it. I will never be part of it. And again, whatever comes out of it must be on your head. God in heaven will bear me witness that I warned you. And whatever good that will come out from this thing that I'm pursuing, you will not benefit from it. Yes. God is bearing me witness. Yes. I don't... Yes. That is yours. Now I demand for an explanation. Who was that girl? Uh, the girl is, is, is my girlfriend. Was she addressed to you as her husband? No, you don't have to mind her. She's just <laughs> saying it for saying sake. You know these village girls the way they, they tend to misunderstand me to their affairs. That's all. I don't have anything. I don't even have any feelings for her. You don't lie to me. Hey, come on. I can't lie to you. I mean it. You're the one I love. 
You know, she's just being jealous because I stopped seeing her and I'm now saying, you know, ladies now. Mora, if we are to have something lasting, you must pledge your heart to me. You must promise me I'll be the only girl you will see. And you must make a lot of sacrifices for me as well. I love you, the only one that I will see. The only one that I will see. Alright? I love you. You don't have to bother about those village girls and what they say, right? Are you sure? I'm sure. You called me. Yes, there is uh, this thing now. Mama, Papa, you won't be on my side now. What did you hear? Oh, Lachi caught Umora cheating on her with late chief for Mekako's daughter. That one that just arrived the village not quite long. Hmm? What are you talking about? Yeah. How do you mean? Umora cheating on her, Lachi. Papa, I failed to tell you what Umora has been telling me. Mora has been seeing that lecture for Mekako's daughter and has been avoiding to see Olachi. Hmm. And today, Olachi caught up with two of them. What? So, such thing has been going on in my house, with her, and you failed to tell me. But why would this boy, eh? Why would he do such thing to such a lovely girl, Olachi? I don't know, Papa. I don't know. Better man. If I may ask. So we have to wait for Mora to come back and explain things by himself. We don't have to judge him. If it is true, I will not forgive that boy. But why should he hurt an innocent girl like that? What kind of heart is this? You mean this is happening now? That's it. I know you should be crying, but what am I going to do? He will kill himself. Wait, oh, are you happy? You are happy, Abi? Mora, I just, I just don't understand you. I'm surprised. I can't believe that you, Mora, is doing this thing now to Olachi, and you're happy with it. The same Olachi that you could not sleep if you did not talk to. The same Olachi that you promised to do everything for. The same Olachi that you could die for. Now you want to leave her because uh, first you just came from nowhere with this with this with this dirty money to front in your face. I'm beginning to feel that your love for her was never genuine. Chike, uh, everyone knows that I have genuine love for Lachi. But the present condition of this country is way too bigger than settling with someone just because of love. Things are bad, my brother. I mean, marry Olachi and Olachi are going there and be suffering. It's not done. We will be born now. We got to be born. Let me see. Please, you have to understand the fact that this is the latest. You have to embrace it. Laura, your head baby. I sincerely believe that you are on the right track. You spot him now. You spot him. Uh -huh. Maybe today get money to the job food. That's all you want. Look at his tummy. It's true. He's eating. Uh, see, uh, if you like supporting, what I'm saying is, me, I am not in support of anything that is going to hurt all at you. What do you expect? Eh? You're entitled to your own opinion. Listen, Chiki. The girl we're talking about now, her father is the richest man in this village. It's not the whole Nigeria. Because that man has talked to the very uh, Kaduna as I heard. It's not the whole Nigeria. But Papa is dead and left all his wealth for the girl. We shall be the one to be controlling and I'll make you my PA. I beg you, me, stop all these things. The girl in question now is in love with our guy, our party party, Mora. Please, let me promise him your marriage. Just look at Mora. Look at him. Look at how fresh he is. You can understand something now, Chiki. Understand? Look at the sneakers you've been putting on for five years. Since I know you, these sneakers, every time you smell up and down, is that how you're going to live your life? Uh, am I complaining? You're not complaining, but we are complaining. We are complaining. And you don't have to complain for me, oh. See, let me tell you. So, both of you now are hoping on this girl's father's money to survive. Yes. Hey! Hey! You okay? See, let me say this thing now. That girl, something inside of me is telling me that that girl, 
that there's something, something wrong with that girl. Nora, just be careful. Shine your eyes, oh. I'm beginning to suspect you. I think you're becoming jealous. Because of the latest positivity that is coming in, in my life, you're becoming jealous. We need to avoid this man. You Seriously. Look at the good news that I've brought to the table. You're meant to rejoice with me and you're here talking rubbish. Huh? You, are you not a man? Can't you go and work, make money and take care of one of chick? I've searched for work now, I do not see. I would like him myself. Eh, hey, because nothing there was held by rent. Nothing there was held by rent. Uh, Mwara. Do you want me to believe that you will admit before my very presence that what your sister said is true? Papa, you wouldn't like me lying to you, would you? Don't be stupid. What a boldness is this? Nay, please calm down. Calm down. Allow him to explain things. Explain what? What else will he say? You heard him. He bluntly admitted it. Um, but Umara. Why would you do such a thing to Olachi? I don't expect you to ask me that question because I've explained everything to you, sister. It makes no sense because Olachi don't deserve any of this okay. and you know it. Okay. I need an explanation for what happened today. What did I do to you? Please tell me. I want to know. I owe you no explanation. This is what you get when you decide to follow a he goat, hoping to transform it into a scent. This is also what you get. When a child decides to disobey his or her parents, believing that you have grown, that you cannot take decisions on your own. But an elder sits down to see you will climb to the, to the mountain, even to the top of an Iroko tree, you will never see it. I looked at this young man, looked into his eyes, I discovered that he is an epitome of failure and disappointment. I did warn, but you people will not hear. Whether you say that I'm an old man, I'm not current. Nani, stop. What you are saying doesn't help matters. You shut up your mouth, this woman. After all, you are the cause of all this problem. You mislead this, 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 this girl. How did I mislead her? Did I not stand against her involvement with that boy from John said? Did I not? Then you are shouting. Then did you not give her out for marriage to him? Yes, I did. To save this family from shame and ridicule. That was why I did that. You have the guts to shout. Which shame, which ridicule? It's more than this at the end result. <laughs> Get home to your family and to say that to your father and your grandfather. <laughs> and you, you, you. Stop that. Shut up your mouth before I hit you with my bad hand. Thank you for this day. Hmm? Don't mention, you made my day. <laughs> Hope you keep to your promise tomorrow. Of course, darling. Definitely I will. Huh? I'll miss you. I'll miss you too, darling. You're such a diva. <laughs> <laughs> Mama. Hi to my sweet looking mother. Good evening, Ma. Mm. Good evening, my daughter. How are you? I'm all right, Ma. And you? How are you doing? I'm fine. And whose daughter is this? <laughs> Mama, she's late chief of Mekago's daughter. Mm -hmm. She's speaking grammar. <laughs> of course, Mama. What do you expect? <laughs> she's a high class chick, born and bred in the city. Mm -hmm. 
Actually, Mama, out of our busy schedule, TC said she's going to come pay us a courtesy visit. Mm -mm. So uh, she brought this few change. She said uh, you can use this and prepare some special delicacies that will suit her kind of person, you know. Mm -hmm. Yes, Mama. Hey. My daughter, thank you very much. I didn't expect this. That's fine, Ma. Yeah. Babe, I'll be leaving now, okay? Okay, darling. I'll see you tomorrow, right? Oh, okay, darling. Thank you. Take care of yourself. Yeah? My son, you mean all this money is only but food? <laughs> Mama, you've not seen anything yet. Tessie has promised to change my life for good if I should propose to her. Hmm? Then what are you waiting for? Propose her! <laughs> yes! <laughs> ah. Mama, Mama, were you not the one coding at me for dishing all that? Hmm. Eh? I never knew mm -hmm. what was happening. Now that I know, please propose to her. Mama, hmm? Tessie is stupendously rich. Mm -hmm. Her I father willed huge amount of money to her account. If I should mm -hmm. marry this girl, our life will change for good. Hmm. Hey, my son. Mama, mama, mama. Then who is all Archie and her family that will stop you from clinging to this golden opportunity? Exactly. Ah, go for her. This is a long time life opportunity that we can't afford to miss. Mama, now you're understanding ah. me. You're now seeing what I'm seeing. Mm -hmm. Mama, mm -hmm. All I want you to do for me mm. is to help me convince Baba. Uh -huh. Get sense into him. Make him understand that this is for the betterment of the family, not for me alone. In that case, you don't have any problem. Don't you know who your mother is? Of course, I know. Ah uh ah. -uh. <laughs> I will convince him. I will talk to him. Not the time that I will call him in order. Don't worry about that. My sweet mother. Yes, now. Sweet, sweet mother. Mm. Mother, mother, oh, mother. Mm, 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 mm. <laughs> okay, mama. No problem. Papa, where are you following up to? Have you seen what you've cost? What did I do? Have you seen what you cost, you evil child? Why did you try to fight her? Mm. Why don't huh? I fight her? Oh, I should just fold my hands and watch her take my husband away from me. Who is your husband? You. All I should listen. What we had in the past is gone. We are no longer together. Stop disturbing the poor girl. What, what, what is the problem? Well, it's not possible. Oh, because of that old woman, that old thing, that's why you're telling me that what we had is not true. If you try this next time, I will give you the slap of your life. Don't tell me. This is the last one I'm giving to you. It's not true. What? No, you will not care. See, it's not history. It's not history. Mama, I don't know why Mora is doing this to me. I have not done anything to him. All I have done is to love Mora. I have never cheated on Mora for even a day. I don't know why he's treating me like this, oh, Mama. I don't know why. I understand what you're saying. I understand you perfectly well. Um, Nani, I, I think you should meet this Mora. Please, tell you that what he's doing to her daughter is not good. Look at the kind of pain that he's inflicting on her. He's not good. Kiko, the such statements remain on your lips. And may the gods forbid that I do so. Never! She inflicted the pain on herself, so let her suffer it. I will only tell you three things that mean the same. One, he who fetches and infested firewood invites the lizard for a feast. Two, a stubborn grasshopper ends up in a hammer town fire. And finally, a stubborn fly follows the corpse to the grave. Continue your discussion. What have you come here to do? I'm asking you. Okay. Your brother left my sister under the rain and started chasing that useless girl that calls herself Tessie. Isn't it? And I know you are behind this. You are even supporting him. But let me leave something to you. Whatever you and your brother will do to my sister today, 
double fold shall be your portion. Uncle, please. I'm not part of this. Neither my mother nor my father is. Mora made this decision on his own. And that is what I came to clarify. If your parents are not in support of this, what are they doing to stop it? Or are they just folding their hands just like that? Mama, there is nothing we've not done to stop him. Oh, he seems to have made up his mind. So, Mora choose to abandon me like this after everything we've shared. There's no problem. Yes, so. Thank you for your good story. Are you still here? Oh, believe me. Leave us! So she suggested we leave this village for now for the city. You know, and I really, really love the idea. She promised that we are we are gonna return to pay her diary. By then this whole heat would have been over. Heat? What's it? Not that she's sad, of course. Have you forgotten? Do you know the amount of pressure that is coming from my family and that of all Lashi? One day, if we don't leave this village now, these people are bent on killing us. And that would have suited you well. <laughs> well, I'm sorry to disappoint you, my dear friend. We are leaving the village for good. What? I am so, so happy for you. <laughs> I can't say anything to be happy about anyway. Of course, because you're blind. Isn't it palpable that you're a blind man? Those that have eyes are already celebrating with me. My man. Your man now. <laughs> if this thing scales, we will celebrate. You will drink plenty of palm wine. <laughs> I you drink more palm wine. <laughs> Don't mind this man. Hey. You're the only one I wish to tell. What we are planning now is to go to the city, travel to the city, chill out for a while till this whole storm calms down. Then we can now come back to the village and pay her diary. <laughs> That's nice, my son. Very nice. You don't have to worry yourself about your dad and your sister. They will be the one to appreciate you. When they see the benefits, it's there. They will be the one to appreciate you. So you don't have to worry. But the only thing you have to do, just give your love and care for her. Of course, Mama. <laughs> you don't have to worry about Is it because of your life? No, 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 Mama. I can't help Tessie like that. Mm -hmm. And the good thing is that mm -hmm. I've grown to love Tessie even more than all Ashi, Mama. You should. Because that's your own heart. You follow your heart. And as it is, it's not that Olaji, that idiot forsaken one who has nothing to offer into your marriage. Exactly, Mama. Mama, Mama. Mm. Mama, you are the only one that understands me very well. <laughs> Mama, dead. You know you're my son. Of course you know you're my son. Don't you see how he looks alike? Of course, Mama. I, I look like you. Who else? I don't if not my mother, who else? You resemble me now. Are you not seeing it? Look at the way you are. Did you resemble your dad? You resemble your father? <laughs> That's good. Hola! Uh. Hola! Hey, 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 hey. Hola. Hola. Hope all is well. No. Are you aware that Mora has finally left this town with that city girl? That's not possible. I saw Mora just yesterday. Okay. I saw them with my own eyes a couple of minutes ago. I am certain about it. I, I also overheard his friend saying it. Are you sure about what you're saying? I am certain about it. You're very sure? Honestly. Let me go and find out. There's no need lying to her. Mama, please tell me it's not true. 
tell me Wara did not follow that girl to the city. Oh, you. I'm so sorry. I did everything possible. I just couldn't. I don't know hey. why. What has killed me? Why? Why? Oh my God! If anyone should tell me that Mora would deceive me like this, if anyone should tell me that Mora would break my hand like this, Amara, I will not believe you. Amara, look at me. Look at what Mora has done to me. What have you come here to do? Have you come to laugh at me? Please get out of his face. Ola, you're still crying. Huh? Why would I laugh at you? Come on. Chiki, are you saying you wasn't part of it? Ah, uh, Amara, how can you say that? Ola, you know we have come a long way. See, Ola is a very good and a decent girl. But she does not deserve what she got. I was against Mora, but he never listened to me. Please stop crying, okay? So it's because I don't have money. Because I don't have money. That was why Mora had the guts to do this Ola. to me. Leave me alone. Mora, there is no problem, Mo. There is no problem. It's only God that will judge us. You see, in this very case, I will win you. My God will judge us. It's okay. Look, Ola. I know that God in his infinite mercy will wipe your tears for you. How can you be crying for that useless boy? That boy does not deserve you at all. Come on. He has moved on with his life and I want you to do the same. Hola, have you seen what I've been telling you? Please stop crying. Wipe your tears and go on. I need to cry this cry. Okay. I know. Nani. Olachi has been like this for days now. I fear for her. She can't continue like this. She needs help. Please. Help on what? She got what she deserves. I stop sounding like this now. Is it her fault that she fell in love with the wrong man? Is it her fault? Yes, it is her fault. It is her stupidity, her stubbornness. Didn't I warn you people? Didn't I? Yes, I did. So, let her go ahead among herself. For once, say something nice now. Stop sounding like oh, that. Shut up, woman. And let me have my peace. Keep quiet, woman. That's all you can say. Keep the one Kabefa.
<laughs> Look at that. Look at your own way. <laughs> I love this woman so much. Hmm? Look into my eyes, you see. Mm -hmm. I'm looking into your eyes, where you see. <laughs> but baby, you know, the truth is that I don't like staying in this village for anything. But having you in my life makes it more, more fulfilled for me. It makes it look like a paradise for me. <laughs> Can't you see that? This is like a poison. <laughs> Makes the village looks like a paradise. Yes. Makes my life so complete. Yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> I love this woman. <laughs> the way the smile puts me off, you know. Makes me want to spend eternity with you. Yes. My like, oh. <laughs> it's okay, okay. Oh, look at that smile. Look at this fine thing. <laughs> <laughs> Let me say one more. No, don't say it. No. I, I don't want to hear you. It's okay. I okay, said it's okay. Okay, okay. Close your mouth. Close your mouth. <laughs> Nothing. She, she's fine. My sister is not in a good mood. Is what, nothing is wrong. I said she's fine. She just needs to rest. <laughs> All at you. Believe me when I said I'm sorry for what my brother did to you. You don't deserve it. You're such a good girl. And I'm sure heaven is keeping record. And he shall wipe your tears away. Be strong. Oh? Be strong and move on. Please. Eh, hey, water. Are you advising my sister in my presence? Mwara, your brother did this to her. And you had, you had the guts to advise my sister. Now, let me, listen to me. I will deal with Mwara. I will deal with Mwara in this community. After dealing with Mwara, I will deal with you too. Go, oh, oh, please. I don't want you to fight him. Oh, Just leave him. I've handed over everything to God. Let God judge I and Mwara. It is only God that will judge us. Just let him be. I will, I will deal with your brother. Who are you telling by? Your brother will see, your brother will see something. I will deal with him in this village. Thank you. 
I'm so sorry. Are you okay? Yes, I'm okay. You sure? Yes. I want to drop you off, okay? Where are you going? I'm going to my house. I want to drop you off. Don't worry, I'm just close. No, please, I insist. Thank please. You. No, no, please. You. You'll be safe, okay? Don't be scared, okay? Last night, but home people, this one will come, that one will come in. But I said, This morning I must come and see my man. You know what? You will take us to our normal joint. Buy us, Nkwobi, Nkwongwo, Isiyu, Mbada, Nchi, Chike. Halele. I come up with the last, what did they have? I come up with the last, what did they I'm interested in that girl. Who? Come on, the one I told you about. Mm. Olachi. Yes, Olachi. Ah. Ah, what's wrong? I mean, why do you ask? Are you. What's, <laughs> it? what's there? <laughs> you know, to be sincere with you, I am searching for a woman I want to marry, but there's something special about that girl. And I think I like her. I would like to know her more. Well, Olachi is a very good girl, though. She's a very, very decent girl. In okay. fact, in fact, she's the most decent girl we have in this entire village. So how, how do I meet her? Do you want me to take you to her place? Will you do that for me? Ah, come on, brother. Come on, let's go there. You can go there. Let's go, let's go right the way. What are we huh? waiting for? <laughs> hey, Olachi. She's not at home. I'm the only one at home. Hope there's no problem. It's not a risk like this. See, I come. My brother won't see her. Excuse me. My name is Kane. Okay, my name is Ugona. Ugona. Nice to meet you. My pleasure. For us, you know, Mora brought all these things. Yes, my dear. Yes, he even bought things for you. Uh -huh. uh, the the young man that brought this thing just left about a few minutes ago. He even gave me his phone to call him, and he told me that he's going to take us abroad. Can't you see the reason of the wise decision that he made to marry the the biggest rich woman? I am so happy. Well, Mama, there is nothing you are going to do to convince me that 
Uora, my brother, is right over what he did to Olachi. Mama, it's not right. You and I know that what he did is not right. Stop! You're a big fool! You're a big fool! Get out of my face! It's not good, though. It's not good. Me, I'm not eating any of this food. You're a big fool! You're a big fool! Get out of my face! Is that why your father just walked out of me like that? Let's go! Enemies of progress! Hey! I'm just happy. I've never taken this place since I was born. Hey! Conflicts! Eh? Uh, even the hot drink, I won't even give you this one. I will hide it. Bag up. Hey! Keep off of my child. Oh, oh, give me, oh, give me, oh, give me. Hey! I'm so happy. I was trying to explain to you, you came out sad down. No, I don't like you though. Sister, it's not fair. What is not fair? Who do you even say gave this to you? Anger, if you see me now, you start talking. But I don't know this person. Why did you receive it? I don't know him. Uh, when you see him, you ask him down. Wait, though. He's like, you don't have respect. I'm talking and you're talking. Are you mad? And it's not a crime for me to have collected this for you. You were not around. I collected it on your behalf. Ugona is a big crime. Who asked you to collect it? Mbatek! I have delivered my message now. What, what, what is this? You said you want to see my daughter. Why, if I may ask? When I, I, I saw this beautiful daughter of yours, Olachi, and uh, she fits into the kind of woman I would love to marry. I met my cousin here, Chike, to inquire much about her. And Chike confirmed to me that she's one of the most decent women in this village that anyone would like to have as a wife. Chike, you did? Yes, Nai. You see, Olachi is a very decent girl. And my brother here has good intentions. Yes, Nai, I do have good intentions for your daughter. Uh, my being here is as regards my father's wish for me to marry a woman from this village. Seeing Olachi, I don't need a suit here to tell me that she's my missing rape. That's why I, I, I came directly to you to declare my intentions before I make it official. Well, I don't have much to say in an issue like this. Because the whole thing depends on the girl in question. But the best I can do for you is to allow you to move close to the girl, sort yourself out with her, and that is that. Thank you very much. I'm really grateful. Okay. Okay. Thank you. It's okay. Papa, it's impossible. It will not work. I cannot marry that man. I can't marry him. Uh, how do you mean you cannot marry him? Because I don't know him. You don't expect me to marry someone I barely know. Then how then do you know somebody without getting acquainted with the person? Papa, I don't like him. I don't want to get acquainted with him. Simple. You must be stupid by saying that. Now, Nkechi, talk to your daughter. The best she can do for herself is to say yes to that young man. I think she needs time. Everything is happening so fast. It's not been long that she experienced heartbreak. And now this one is coming up. Please, I think I understand her point. Yes. She has no valid point. This is it. I said it. You are the one deceiving this girl. Mm. It is you. Can I see the son of Iba That is rich, energetic, young, industrious. In fact, this boy has all it takes to be a man. You cannot compare him with that, that, that hooligan you dated. Now listen. Don't ever allow that boy to slip out of your hand. Because if you do, I will not forgive you. If you do, I will not forgive you in this house. In addition to that, Olachi, 
I suggest you give that man a chance. Shut up. Give him a chance, so he might be the right person for you. The right man you have been longing to have. I heard that he has money. He has good money. He will take good care of you. If you ask me, he's the right man for you. Please give that. Papa? You said you want so to money. Papa? Don't mind them. Just relax. Come down, come down. Where are you going? I was going to your house to return this to you. So you think you can buy my house with gifts and money? Okwaya? You cannot. That was why you went behind me to tell my father that you want to marry me without even letting me know. Because you think you have money. Oh, Kenneth, because you have heard about my story. That is why you want to take advantage of me. Okwaya, it will not work for you. Take this, I don't need it. I'm not trying to buy your love. Neither did I hear anything about you. I, I did this from my heart. Okay? Listen, I know you must have had terrible experiences in the past from me, but I am different. Okay, just give me a chance. I love you. I am not here to play you. <clears throat> exactly what Mwara has been telling me. Mwara told me so many things, so... At the end, what happened? Ola, I am not Mwara or any other man you met in the past. I am different. Ola, listen, you are special. You deserve a good man. All I ask is for you to give me a chance, please. Okay? I will prove you wrong. Please. Okay, yeah, just come, let me drive you home, okay? Kimichi is a very good man. Besides, he's my kinsman. Look, I. I know how you feel right now. I understand that you are still in pain. I know what Mwara did to you. I knew Mwara was never the right person for you. And yet I allowed him to mess you up. And I hate myself for that. Listen to me, Ola. My brother Kenichi will take good care of you. He loves you so much. Please just open up your heart for him. You deserve to be happy. You deserve to smile again. I promise you, you are going to be the luckiest girl on earth if you just open up your heart for him. Please, just think about it, okay? Son, I wonder why you are suddenly back to the village. And not only that, you are behaving the way you are. I hope, is everything all right? All is all right, Papa. I know, by the look of things. I don't need to be told. So, where is your wife? Papa, don't even call that bitch my wife. This is a huge disappointment. I still cannot tell the reason she treated me the way she did. I just don't deserve it. Tell us everything. I, I don't know how to put it. But the truth is that when we got to the city, things changed. This is started acting funny. So that is it, Papa. This is threw me away like a trash. Like a trash? That's what you are. You deserve it. This is Nemesis. Look at what you did to an innocent girl, all right? Hey! Eh? Hey! Papa, don't even mess your own life. God has wiped her tears for what Mora did to her. Huh? Meaning? All that she is married, not only married, though, but married with a man with so much money. My brother, even where they wash his car, cannot be employed there. What? No! She's waiting for you. Mm hmm. Mm. I realized that I, I could not love any other woman like I loved her life. Oh. No need fooling myself. 
you know, after all this, all these months, I, I couldn't sleep. I keep thinking about this woman. So I decided to come back home and, and, and start again. This is someone I love. I don't have to deceive myself. So that is it. You know. how, how are you people? Have you finished? Yeah, I'm, I've, I've finished. Chige, is he talking to both of us? Was he saying something? What? If not that you are not my friend, eh? if not that you are not my friend, I will tell you what. Walker. Walker. You mean you left that rich girl in the city only for you to return here and start access of all large? Of course, love, love has no boundaries. This is the woman I love. I can do anything for her. Don't you think, Chike? Mwana, now I can see that you're not just confused and dumb. You're also mad and stupid at the same time. No, Chike, you don't have to insult me. Ah, insult? Simora, if I have my way, I will beat the living hell out of you right now. Mm. Look at this fool. Anyway, what am I even beating you for? If I beat you now, you will die. Nature is already taking care of you. You will see it now. What do you mean by that? I still have money. I came back with a lot of, a lot of money. So I'm not alone, alone, alright? If that's what you're thinking. Look at who's talking about money. Before I tell you one thing, Chike, you are not my friend. 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 In case you've not heard, all Hashi is happily married. As a matter of fact, she now lives in the city with her rich husband. Do you even know who she's married to? She's married to my own kinsman, Kenechuku Ibanusi, the richest man in this entire village. That's a lie. Oh, that's a huge lie. It can never happen. I don't care if it's Dangote or anybody. No one has the right to give my wife to another man. It's impossible. Yes. Look at this fool. You're a madman, Mora. You're a foolish boy. Go to the other and insult me. Don't insult me. Oh, oh. What is this? I see Get out of my house. Get out of my house, you fool! Mola, ever since you left the city for this village, there have been a lot of stories. You tell this person a different thing, you tell the other person a different thing. In all this, I know that this truth has not been said. That's why I come to you now, as your very good friend. For you to confide in me and tell me the truth, because I need to know. <laughs> I'm saying this because you need someone to confide in, and that should be me. So tell me the truth, because I know you need help, and I'm here to offer that help. But I can't give you any help if you don't tell me what is going on. I have to understand the situation on ground, so I know how to help you. I don't think there's any point in hiding what happened because you've been my the one friend I mean, and my secret has always been safe for you. The thing is, when I got to the city with Tessie, everything was moving on fine. We are loved up, we are living like husband and wife. But at, at the long run, I, I started noticing some funny attitude they seem to especially with her phone. She was no longer free with her phones. If she's answering call and sights me coming, she will hang up. 
And I, I do see this particular guy that comes to the house all the time, which I even thought is the cousin or relation. But I was wrong. I came home one afternoon and behold, I saw this same guy kissing and smooshing Tacy on the couch. I couldn't believe my eyes. I tried confronting Tacy. Tacy, what's the meaning of this? Do you know what Tacy told me? Uh, uh, Wara, uh, I'm sorry to tell you uh, this, even though it might hurt you. What we had in the past is, is history uh, that she's no longer interested. I was shocked. Tacy, are you actually telling me this? He said, yes. The guy tried to fight me. And all Tessie could tell me is that, Mora, please, I want you to leave my house. They threw me out of the house. Okay, you go. Tessie threw me out of the house. I was humiliated. The only thing on my mind now is Olashi. Okay, please. Olashi is the woman that I truly love. I know I've done mistakes in the past and I'm here to correct them. I want you to assist me. I need her back in my life. You're talking of impossibility. I can't help you. It is possible because we were in love. It's we not. can still come back together. It's, it's not. You see why I don't want to tell you? You keep asking me, say it, say it. Now, what are you going to do? Nothing. I thought you were talking about something feasible. Something we can do. Not an impossible task. We can do it. Getting we back can. a married woman. The girl you ditched. Have you forgotten your story with this girl? I'm not going anywhere. Mom! You have anything to say? Say it here. Not in my house. I said, I am here to see my Olashi. I paid her dowry, and she's still my wife. As tradition demands, she is still my wife. Please just bring her out. Let me go with my woman. What is wrong with you? Don't you have shame? Eh? Don't you have shame? We are talking of shame. The right question would have been Is he not scared? Is he not afraid? Walk into this compound and open his dirty mouth to ask for life. Afraid? Afraid of what? Afraid to come and see my own wife, the woman I rightfully married. Nana is Ah, I see. You still have the girl to stand here. Open your dirty mouth to sweet this nonsense. You. I see. All right, wait a minute. If you know what is good for you, leave this compound now before my husband comes back. You inflict any injury on you, you use your head to carry it. Leave this place now. Action. See, before he Action. comes back. Is that how you put want it? No, no problem. I'll come back. Come back. Come, 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 come back. Come, 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 come. Where are you going? Come back. Come back. Come back. Come and carry your wife. Come and carry your life. His waist. <laughs> Come, idiots. Mazuki. Uh oh, uh, Izuna. Yeah. I am going to your place. I hope all is well. Maybe you didn't inform your son that I have duly returned the diary he paid on my daughter's head. Actually, I have not because I've been watching my son for some time, has not been talking anything about your daughter. So I decided to see whatever is happening. But well, he left my place a few minutes ago, threatening that he will bring down my building if I don't return all that to him. What? Is he mad? I should be asking you that question if he is mad. But even if your son is a madman, let him understand that my house is not a psychiatric center. Because any other day I see him there, I will end him up. I will kill him. He is your son. I'm very sorry. So I'm very call sorry. him to us. I'm very sorry for that. I'm sorry. I will talk to him. I wonder where this madness is coming from. Children of the days, I will talk to him. I will take care of this matter. Please. You better do. I'm going back to my house. That's not possible. I never asked anyone to return the diary I paid on Olachi's head. Olachi is still my wife. Better go and return that diary to them and bring back my wife to avoid problems. Ismail, are you insane? When did you start taking India him? 
Papa, this is not a matter of smoking Indian hem. This is about my wife hem or, or whatever. You're talking nonsense. I said you're talking rubbish. This is the day you publicly disgraced and denounced because one mommy water showed up. Hey? Eh? That you're willing to concede that dowry as a compensation for whatever inconveniences that might have caused them. You did so. But let me tell you, stay away from Mazo Christie. Oh, Jikwale God, for, for whatever he does to you, he will not be blamed. This is all what I have to tell you. I don't want to know anything he wants, let him do. I'm ready to do anything to get back my wife. I mean it to Papa. Ah, Mama, you're not saying anything. Don't you have anything to say in this issue? I gave you my support. When you dish Alaji for that rich girl, obviously I was literally behind you. Only for you to come back here some months later and Tete telling us that you want Alaji back. <laughs> We've told you several times that Alaji is married though. She's married to another man, War. She's married. But why would they give my woman out to another man, knowing the fact that I paid her dowry? War. You're looking for trouble, and I hope you know that. Or they're the ones looking for my trouble. No, you're the one looking for their trouble. Well, I trust Mazo Casey. He will deal with you. Look, you paid for all Archie's dowry, that I know. But you publicly divorced her. You even asked her family to take whatever you paid on her head. Now that Tessie has divorced and dumped you, you are back looking for the same girl you vomited. My friend said what you know. Who told you that this chased me out of the house? This that adorns me, that is ready to sacrifice her whole self for me. But please, you can tell that to the birds. This dumped you and chased you out of her house. That is what I know. I don't know about Odeka. <gasps> oh, I did not know. <laughs> Who would believe such? It's obvious she got tired of him. <laughs> I used her left leg to kick him out of the house. <laughs> Power that you guys are fools. Eh? fools. I don't even know why I, I, I befriend you people in the first place. Animals. I will blow you. See this I'll... guy. One day I will slap her. We'll see him. I will blow you. You know, miss you, but make sure you return as promised, okay? I will. <laughs> you didn't do that, baby. <laughs> you know, my sunshine. Yes. Bye bye. Wait, 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 wait,
Let him go. What are you doing in this compound? I'm asking you. Don't come here and don't talk to Please, please. Who can tell you? I don't want my husband to come back here and meet you. Just get out! Oh, no, please. Remember what we said. Just leave. Why would I be doing that? Why would I be doing that? Why would I be doing that? Make sure you come back to this house. Use less hopeless food. It's yours. <laughs> Impossible though, he refused to go. I said, Open the gate. I should open the gate. Okay. What is this? Please let me explain. Please calm down. 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 I will hear you out. But that will be at the police issue. Eh? Eh. How do you mean it? Eh, what I mean is that I have contacted them. That is where you explain to I and my husband what you have been coming to this house to do. It doesn't to do that. No, it has. Oh. It has. Take a good look at your love. Take a good look at one. And look at what they did to me. Just, just look at one. Let me tell you. You see this thing you're doing. It will not help you. Emotional blackmail. No, Allah. This is no emotional blackmail. I was beaten black and blue because I, I couldn't afford money to pay for my food. Allah. I know I have done that. I, I know you. You will not. Accept me in your house, but even though it's money for tea fair, just, just let me just get out of here. Money for what? Tea fair? Bros, shishin! Money again. I'm not going to give you 10 kobo. It's better you get out of this place. Just leave. Do you hear me? Else I'll call the police to come and arrest you. You better run! Oh, you got into that. Mike! Yes, madam. Please close this gate for me. Nah, no, no, no. You're a madman.
high. Is something wrong with you? He will die here. Hey, this is high fever. This is fever. Oh. Mora, what is this thing now? What kind of problem is this? What kind of problem is this? Mike, no. No. What will I tell my husband if he comes back? You know what? You just have to go to the gates. Let me go and get drugs for him, okay? Be fast about it. Go! know what I need from you. What do I do? What am I going to do now? Because I don't want him to see you. I don't want him to meet you here. Um, no, okay. this is our guest room. But please, make sure you don't come out. Make sure. No, I'm going to cause you trouble there. Okay. Just say, don't come out to my grave. You okay? And I couldn't stand, I was missing my my sweet wife's nutritious food. Yeah, it's very Really? Yeah. Come here. <laughs> I can't wait. I always tell my friend this time, my wife is the best cook. I find it for good, you know. My love, um, you guys are having my favorite thing. Let me get you to get it. Okay. What is your problem? I thought you said you were sick. Yes, so the hunger chased me out of the bed. Eh, and you couldn't just wait for me to finish eating with my husband. <laughs> to hate me, that you don't care if I die of hunger. Remember what we shared together. Please. Just shut up. Shut up your mouth. When I am done eating, I will come and serve your food. Make sure you don't leave this room. Else, you will not like what I will do to you. I need it more than every other thing in this world right now. My conscience has, has never stopped flogging me for all the wrong things that I did to you. How could I have foolishly lost the precious gift God gave to me? What is your problem? I know you're very stupid. You're a stupid person, yes, but it's late. I don't need all those things you're saying. Just go! It's never gone. We still have time to rectify things. We still have time to come back. Do you want to check me out? My love, you are married, yes. But you are not married to your heart. What nonsense are you talking about? Who said so? Are you in my heart? Please, just leave me, okay? I mean the whole thing that I'm telling you right now. I, I could not continue with Tessie because I, I couldn't find you in her. I left her. Mother, you mean you left Tessie for me? I swear down, when I left, happiness left me completely. My life became shattered. I, I thought I, I could still come back to you only to be told that you're married to another man. I almost died. Mama, what's wrong with you? 
Mora, your ex? Yes, I am Mora. No, what were you thinking? That she loves you truly when her true love is out there. Listen, Mr. Man, I have come to take possession of what is truly mine. And that you shall have. How could you be so careless? Olachi, what is wrong with you? You know Mora is a, is, a, is, is a devil himself, yet you allowed him to come close to you. What is wrong with you? I was deceived. Mora blackmailed me. He, he has ruined my life. No. Mora did not ruin your life. You ruined your life by yourself. Because you are stupid and messed up. After all the things the boy did to you, you could not learn your lessons. Olachi, 
I am disappointed at you. <laughs> Papa, I didn't know he had such evil plan. I didn't know. <laughs> I'm just a stupid person. I'm so stupid. Of course you are so stupid indeed. I have no single blame for your husband. As a matter of fact, if you ask me, I will tell you, you are a wrong candidate for him. Hey, Papa. Nani. Hey, please don't talk like that. Do not talk like that. Don't shut up, woman. Keep quiet and don't provoke me anymore. Don't! Because you are the cause of all this. You are the cause of all this, woman. And you know it. Now, at the end of the day, after everything, look at where you landed her. Mm. Blame me for everything. I'm the cause of every wrong thing in this whole planet. Yes, I am. I was the one who even sent water to her house. It's okay. Mama is not okay. It's okay. I, I just feel like killing myself. Please don't do that. Please. Go. <laughs> Calm down, my love. Calm down. Eh? Isn't it obvious that I'm the only true love you have now? Look at the manner he, he threw your things out of the house. He couldn't even wait for you to explain things to him. My love, think about what I told you the last time. Let's eliminate this man and take possession of all his wealth. That's the only thing. You are here with devil. You're just a devil from the pit of hell. If you know what is good for you now, just leave this compound. I said, leave! Get out! Get out of this compound! Get out! Don't ever come back here again! Please, let's <laughs> what is it? Huh? What is the problem, Olachi? Olachi, what is it? Olachi, what is it? Now talk to us. Olachi. Listen. That boy ruined my girlfriend's life. He did not only steal her away from me, but threw her away like a trash. Exactly. I want him dead. I want him dead. I learned he will be visiting the village this weekend. Yes, this weekend. Come immediately so we can plan on how to eliminate him. Good, good, good. Thanks, man. You always got my back. Thanks. Okay. See you then. Mora. I want you! I want you to go I want you to Take this bus out of the way! Move! arrested by the police in the attempt to murder Kenichi. Are you serious? But why do you want to murder that innocent young man? Because he's stupid. He's very stupid. He believes Kenichi stole Olachi from him. Olachi? The Olachi he dumped and disgraced? That's why I said he's very stupid. If he is a bit reasonable, what he should have done is to go on his knees, beg Kenichi for forgiveness. Yes. Because he wronged that guy. He tore his family apart. I mean, Kenichi and Olachi were living happily. They were happily married. God himself involved and tore the family apart. Now, the only thing you could think was to attack him, trying to kill him. But my happiness is that he failed and he will continue to fail. Now he's going to remain behind bars. He's going to rot in jail for ages. 
That means our God in heaven have intervened for Kenichi. Of course. Was it not for the divine intervention of God, they would have succeeded. He's going to rot in jail for ages. Oh, oh, oh. 